Hey there folks, welcome back to the channel. I'm the Big Puma, wherever you may be and however you may be watching. Thanks for making this video a part of your day. Welcome back to the story mode, Rudo's campaign for Lucha Libre, Eros del Ring. In the last one, we took on Zombie Clown and Psycho Clown, and we were getting beat so badly, we had to cheese it and get a count out victory. That was a pain in the butt. And then um, we were psychosis in this psychosis versus this alan stone matchup here and of course got the victory there and now we are moving along charlie manson versus electroshock a rumbling voice grabs everyone's attention charlie manson has arrived and he's demanding his brother's presence family ties are not to be taken lightly electroshock must answer the call of the blood as we take a look at the bios here make sure you hit that subscribe button Turn on notifications with the little bell so you know when we go up, uh, go live, excuse me, every weekday, Monday through Friday. Let's look at Electroshock here. Dude, what a get up this guy has. Actual stable, Los Wagner, Wagner Maniacos, 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 that sounds weird. Dr. Wagner, I'm assuming, is a part of that. Family is, his brother is Charlie Manson, and we we're about to face off, and Lady Apache is his wife 18 years in the biz charlie manson now 20 years in the biz no stable at the moment but he was in vatos locos vipers the black family la secta vipers revolution uh two three masks earned sagittario and los sagittarios one and two and then hair el intruso arena negra electroshock el zorro and x fly his brother is electroshock wow all right, let's get into this match. I'm, I think we're gonna be Electroshock. He looks like the bad guy here, but Charlie Manson could be too. I don't freaking know. Who knows? Energy in 200 pounds of pain, ladies and gentlemen. He is the Predator. He is Electroshock. has overcome injuries and stared death in the face. Let's rock and roll with Charlie Manson. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It's time for Lucha Libre. It's time for a fight with no limits. All right, so it, okay, right off the bat, we are Electroshock. And apparently, Electroshock and Voorhees have the same. Oh gosh, have the oh, nope, have the same entrance. Oh, too early. Oh, right into an armbar. Not today, fool. Now something I did see. Oh, he reversed our clothesline. Um, Rudos get a little more popularity when outside the ring. You know, because that's not a good guy thing to do. That's a bad guy thing to do. Um, so, I think... Now, now, if you're following along, the popularity is up there in the upper left and upper right. And once it fills up, then, you know, of course, you get uh, your finisher. Ho! Oh! I don't know how to uh, dive out of the ring. Too early. Oh shoot. We're getting smoked. It is a 20 count, I think. Not a 10 count. Yes, that's correct. But now we're at 12. Yeah, we gotta get back in the ring. Oh, sheesh. Just too late on those reversals. I need to... Sheesh. I need to practice up on those things, and I don't know what he's doing. There we go. Get a little bit extra being outside the ring, you know. Into a nice neck breaker there. Up and down onto his head. Oh, shoot. It's 13. I'm going to let him kick out so we can get back in the ring. There we go. Boy. They can grab you at any time. 
It doesn't matter what you're doing. Oh, shoot. I was looking at the wrong guy for whatever reason. Get off me. Here's a little power move action. Electrocutioner. Educutioner, I should say. Yeah, we will. Working those legs. Boy, I, let me tell you, a one-on-one -on -one matchup is way, way easier to handle than, than a two-on-one -on -one for sure. Dang. Whoa. Oh, no. That's not good. No. Shoot. Gory special. Why isn't he going for the pin, though? Now, now he is. Oh, 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 goodness. I can't do him. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. But that, uh, we'll just give you a couple of kicks. We gotta, we can't do a bunch of power moves at the moment. Um, because of our popularity is not up to snuff. Oh, I went to for a big old kick and he were First it, ugh. No, get off me. Uh-oh, I pushed the wrong button. Apparently X does nothing. Really? There we go, get off me. Uh-oh, he said the same. Get off me. Get your butt out of my ring. And a big ol' elbow drop to the out. What just happened? I don't understand. I don't know if I want to go into the ring, though, because he's got his finisher. If we just mess with him a little bit, he uh, he won't be able to do it. Get outside the ring. Oh, nice. Oh, shoot. There. So so see up there in the top right, It he, he cooled off. Uh oh No, 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 no. There we go. Get off me. There we go. And back to the, back to the smaller moves because of our thing here. Oh, he reversed us. Jeez. Really? Like, see, big old giant kick. And he just manages to get a bulldog in. Nope, not today. Yeah, we'll, we're going to tear those legs up. Oh, surfboarding. Whoa, he got out of that super fast. There we go. Nice, into a neck breaker. Now, there's a dinging noise, and I'm not positive on what that is. Educutioner. Uh-oh. Yeah, it wouldn't let me do another move. So I had to do the Executioner again. Will it let us do it now? Nope. Different one, though. Oh, holy smokes! Get off me. There we go. Into a front face slam. Nice. Oh, he reversed us. Golly, that move is brutal. Here's a big one. Oh, Brain Buster. Nice. Uh-oh. Too early. Too late. That's alright. That's alright. He's doing some taunting because he gets a little bit of a... Dang. He gets a little bit of a boost. And every time um, he does a move to us, I want to say it takes away some of our... Um, popularity, which would make sense. Here we go. Into a front face lock. Nice. Just punching a dude in his stupid head. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, maybe I did. Dude, barely getting the victory. We didn't get to do our finisher, but that's alright. We are bleeding. Wow. 
Technicals are running out of options. Alan Stone got his own special rule of beauty treatment. And Electroshock thought his little brother a serious lesson. Unfortunately, it seems her plans have been discovered. And we'll need to find a hideout. Alright, so it looks like the Rudos are going to have to find a new hideout. Because now their plans have been figured out. They are uh, taking it to those... Um, to those Technicos. We have got here... Um, Vampiro Candanis, Can Canada, Can Canadines. I have no idea what I'm saying. The young Rudo thinks the moldy the moldy workshop where he honed his lucha libre skills will make a good hideout. But El Vampiro, yep, is about to prove him wrong. One match, one v one. I'm sorry, no count out, no DQ. Oh, it's Vampiro. Okay, I mean yeah. So um, Vampiro again. My first dealings with him in WCW a long time ago. No masks earned, but he has earned the hairs of Bestia Negra the second, Pirata Morgan, Sangre Chicana, and Rey Bocanero. All right, and you know I don't think it says anything about. Uh, uh, oh, Triple A Heartthrob El Vampiro. Interesting. All right, let's get this match on the road. Bath in the shadows of the old workshop. I agreed to meet Kenzo, but just moments into our meeting, Vampiro Canadiense and Granda burst into the workshop looking for trouble. Who will be the first to suffer my wrath? Vampiro accepts my challenge. Take your best shot, amigo. All right. And we're gonna just blast, homie. Uh oh. Dang. Kicked our legs out from underneath this. There's really no way to reverse that top rope move. Um, can I? Oh, I can. Cheese and rice. Just wrecking fools. You know, a lot of this has been, you know, not Voorhees. That's been interesting. You know, it's been another. Uh, you, you've been playing as other characters. Can we get him here? Oh. And we are putting it on Vampiro right now. Holy smokes. Alright, we're going to spin whack and just work on those legs. Oh. That's something else. We could just, you know, work on the legs and take him out oh man we're ready to go here dude here we go bam and now we just go for the pin like uh oh oh and he kicked out interesting dang big old shot to the head I right, just out of reach that's annoying that's annoying. Oh, you know what? And it's no DQ. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to drop you. And I'm going to go get a weapon. There we go. Oh, light tubes to the face. And now he's bleeding. Come on. There we go. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that, but I'll, I'll go. Oh, I thought there was no count out. Hold on. Does it tell us match options? No DQ. Oh, is it a 20 count? Okay. And no time limit, I see. You dummy. I'm going to get back in the ring. But there's no DQ, so... Oh, shoot. I dropped it. Uh oh, yeah, I didn't want him to go pick it up. Grab him. Grab him. Boom! Alright, I'm gonna wait for him to stand up. Can I taunt with this thing? I can. Oh, I just whacked it on my own head. Smashed! Oh. Dude! And. Oh, yeah, we're going to work the legs again. Uh, not so much this time. I thought 
After a couple of times, it would wear him down, but it doesn't look like it. Uh-oh. Too late. Oh, he is bloody. He is bloody. There we go. Get your... Get off me. Got him up. Look at this big running power bomb. Nice. And we're just going to choke him out. Uh-oh. Night. Ugh, I kind of want to do my finisher again. There we go. There we go. Now we can. Now we can pin him. <laughs> Got to get that finisher in first, you know. You know. Now we can get the victory. And he. There ain't no way he's waking up. Bing, bing, bing. Heck yeah. Okay. So we in this video uh, we did. A brother lesson. Two brothers facing off and his electroshock. Then we took on Vampiro. They said his name. I can't say that, so <laughs> I'm going to just call him Vampiro. Hunting the Bloodsucker. And then in the next one, we're going to start off with uh, Kinzo. Oh, oh, Kinzo's help. I see. Mantis Religioso. And if there's time, we will take on Granda as Kinzo Suzuki. So Kinzo Suzuki's the Rudos. The Rudo, excuse me, and Granda is the Technico, but the man is the devil. He looks like a bad guy. So, okay. But uh, that is going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, please leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you're not. Hit the notification bell so you get all the notices when we post a new video every weekday, Monday through Friday. And uh, go check out the Patreon if you haven't done that. We will see you next time.